All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. GNGS Design Custom Wraps coming at you in DeKalb, Illinois. Yes, sir, in DeKalb, Illinois. Anyways, we just came back from vacation. Myrtle Beach. Oh, yeah, baby. Anyway, so what we're going to do today is a GMC pickup truck. So on this pickup truck, I got a little creative here. So think about it. So if you're looking at this GMC truck, what do you guys see? I'll give you a few seconds to take a look at it and see what you think. Yeah, much. Late. All right, so what I see when I look at this truck, I see an eyeball, an eyeball over there, a big ass nose, and you see that? It's a smile on its face, it's like it's smiling at you. But that nose right there, we gotta do something about that nose. So the customer changed out the grill. So when he changed out that grill, what we're gonna do is we're gonna change this black part right there. It's going all the way around the outer edge right there. And we're gonna make it the same color of blue here and match it up, minus the dirt and dust that's on it. And then we're also going to do a GMC right here. Just that way it brings it out a little bit so it's different. Bet you guys didn't think about that, huh? It looks cool, huh? Imagine if your car looked like a dog. <laughs> Just kidding. Anyway, so this is the color we're going to be working with. This is the Avery blue. It matches it. It took literally a week and a half to get here. And I told the customer two weeks ago we'd be here and ready. So we had to actually extend the lead time because... They didn't have the stuff in stock. Normally it comes out of, uh, uh, I can't want to say, I want to say Michigan, but it came out of Nevada area because the, um, that's the only thing, I got the leftovers. So they only had eight feet left. So I snatched that up real quick. But uh, hey, like, subscribe, hit the notification button. The next vehicle that we're going to be doing is a BMW Roadster. So it's red, but I'm about to do some cool stuff for it for them. So see you at the end of the video. Until then, peace out. Thanks for watching. All right, so now that we got the grill done, we're gonna be working on these mirrors here. So these mirrors here, I'm gonna clean them all up. You can see kind of, let me show you something. So when I'm talking about mirrors, you see how the cap comes up and around and folds over and it's got this part right there. So I'm gonna actually do this in two pieces. So because there's no need for it to come across and then try to make that bend right there, it's, it'd be a pain in the ass. But, sorry, excuse me, it'd be a pain in the butt. Gotta be correct there. So I'm gonna use this body line as a cap to hold all this together. So you guys will see that. So uh, here we go, let's knock these out real quick so Cus, we can have his truck on a Saturday and enjoy the rest of his day.
All right, guys, last but not least, the last thing we got to do is take this GMC logo right here, and I'm gonna take it, my uh, veneer over here, which I pretty much already kind of measured out what it is already, so on the veneer, so if you've never used a veneer before, basically, it's a, I got a digital one because I don't want to need the whole the old way. Be smart about it. So basically, from edge to edge right there, as you can see, for the height-wise, is 3.075. So then now the only thing I do is measure the distance from, from the G to the C and start printing it out and then I'll lay it out. So 3.075 is where we're at. All right guys, we are at the end of the video. We got this whole thing knocked out. So now, now check it out. Doesn't look like a little lost puppy now, does it? Cause you know you want one of them too. And now look at it. See, the, the blue around it looks a lot better even the GMC, it looks totally different. I like it a lot. Hope he does too. So, yeah, look at that. So here we go. Do a quick little walk around right here. Then we did the mirrors. But I really do like what the, how the front grill turned out. So, but hey, hit the like, subscribe, notification button. And like I said before at the beginning of the video, we have a BMW Roaster coming in tomorrow. So stay tuned. Until then, catch you guys in the next video. Peace out. It's been a wrap, yo.